Welcome back everyone, Kremlin Archer here time for some more Frostpunk, so I'm gonna be straight up with yous, guys. I think this civilization will be dead. Straight up. We've got food problems, we got health problems, I'm pretty sure we're, we're uh, we're gonna be dead, deadzo. In, I don't say short order, but eventually, but, um couple of things I want to do though. Somebody was pointing out that I should really get this extended shift thing so that we can um, just choose individual places for the for stuff to happen. Which I think we will sign. Which I think we should probably, that's probably the first thing we should sign. Maybe? I don't know. The other thing is I think I'm going to get safe child shelters and then do this medic, medic apprentices, engineering apprentices thing. So that's a two that's a two step one. So I think maybe we'll just get the extended shifts for now. But yeah, I'm really worried about food. I don't think I can probably pass that. No, you, you can't do that with the hunters huts. It's just not not so oh, it's not a surprising thing. So, yes, I know amputees. I have a lot of them. Twelve of them. Oh, I have to make an. I have to open a new. That's right. We have to open a new medical post because I told them I would. I can't really build anything right now, though. But I should have a new thing, right? I learned how to make those like steam watchmodules. Steam hub. When powered by a generator, these contraptions create additional smaller heat zones around them, each steam. Yeah, so we should put we should build some of those. What are we working on here? Hothouse. That's right. How's the temperatures? That's okay. Not great, but it's okay. These these houses out here I don't really like being chilly, but there's not really much we can do about it. So, so we put a steam so we can put a steam thing out there, potentially. We're gonna have to wait till more we'll have to wait till we get some more resources in here first. I hope this works, that, that two fully two two both of these that these both function to get more food. Hope that hap hope that works the way I think it's going to. Lots of coal. Well, actually, we only have about a day's worth of coal, apparently. <laughs> Thought we had lots of coal. It's fully staffed, right? Yes. Coal pile depleted. Alright, and then this thing kicks back in to pull more coal up. Yes, I see now. We're about to have more people join us too, which is not really something I'm thrilled about, if I'm going to be honest with you. So it didn't really seem like this worked. Like, I feel like having two of these didn't actually bring us any more food than it should have. But I don't know. Alright, hang on. Pause for a second here. I need to build a new medical post or else my people are going to be very angry with me. Someone also pointed out to me that you can you can rotate these things which is kinda neat except for it doesn't actually seem like it changes the amount of size that they take up so it doesn't serve that much of a purpose. Just put it right there. Alright, what do we have food wise? Still just those two things. 
What happened? A child's plea. Found a boy frozen to the bone in the cemetery next to a fresh grave. He must have been there for hours. He wants you to call an emergency meeting. He says that if you agree, his mother will wake up and attend. He must face his loss. Sorry, kid. Sucks out here at the end of the world. 26 3 gravely. Yeah. This is not going well. This the hot house is gonna be done soon. All right. So if I wanted to do one of these steam hubs, I need twenty steel, which I don't have. Hot house has been researched, which is my. Top priority, because food is a definite issue. Oh, this takes a f steam core. Well, I mean, we need it. We gotta have it. There's no debating this one. Survivors. Survivors reach the city. They're all tired and they'll need a place to rest and a bite to eat. And some medical tissue, but they are ready to lend a hand however they can. Alright, well, you're gonna go hungry, is unfortunately what you're gonna do. It's a steam core. We just used our first steam core. Steam cores are a necessary component in advanced technology. We can't manufacture steam cores in the city, so let's hope that our scouts find them during expeditions. I see. Alright, my book of laws is ready to go again. So we're going to get the Child Labor Safe Jobs Act. Oh, did I just do that wrong? Whoops. Damn it! Clicked on the wrong thing. I meant to click on the other one because I wanted to do this guy. Oh well. Have fun, kids. <laughs> Bad food, people had yeah, cold at home. Yeah, we're not gonna have enough. Oh, yeah, we need one and a half places for things. Extracts iron ore from deep deposits and processes them into steel. Alright, so this is the kind of thing that you put here. Okay. Is that the only steel deposit? Coal deposit. Iron ore. Just checking on things here. I need a steel works. Then we will put a. It goes there. It goes there. I gotta remember to do that in the other order. In fact, actually, let's do this. Cancel that. I'd rather build that first. Now you can put that down. Wait, actually. Does this thing have different sizes? No, it just sits there or it doesn't sit there at all. What is this? <sighs> Always with the medical beds. I'm not gonna address this issue right now. Leave me alone. I just gave you a new medical post. building this why is this why is this one little thing here 
What are you doing? Yeah, whatever. Make me food. Oh, we never said another. Uh, well, we don't. We don't have one. We're not gonna have the the materials to do any of this. It takes steel. These are all gonna take steel now, right? Yeah. Bunkhouse. That's actually probably. This is actually probably what we should do next, is the bunkhouse. Really? kids in that job. Other places can have kids, these this place. Got a lot of engineers out of that last group that came into came into the town. This is what? Just wood. Let's have a heater. Yes, turn that on. All right. All right. Okay. Boom. <clears throat> to to Actually, make some food here. Three an hour. Got another cold wave coming up soon. That's right, we do still have homeless. And I can't build a tent in here, right? This is the one that annoys me, is not being able to put a tent in here. I actually really like, if we get to the point where we have, if food stabilizes, I'm gonna move this cookhouse back up a thing so we can put more stuff in there. Also. This should be able to work now, probably. Not enough wood. There we go. Alright, so let's look at this real close here. We got the bunkhouse, which is good, because it will give people more appropriate places to live. Medical post upgrade will heal people faster. The wall drill drills into the walls of our crater, uncovering trees that once formed forests beyond. So that's if we, when we run out of wood in the crater, we need this. So we, but we don't need this right now. That'll go 25% faster. We can make coal out of charcoal. Coal out of wood, basically. Make coal mines. Store more resources. <laughs> this has not been a problem for us yet. We're not running out of storage space. More scouts. Additional teams. Generator upgrade. Range upgrade. I actually think I want this one. It'll give us the option of extending the range out a notch. I don't know, I guess. I don't know. I'm gonna use these engineers. I got them, I might as well use them. No point in having them just sitting around. Hunger is going down. People are still sick. Homeless. 
Guess we'll make some more tents here. Probably gonna leave those last two homeless. Um, because it's kind of a pain to do otherwise. We're out of wood. I don't know, give it a bit. Still got 823 within range of this guy. I'm gonna put this guy. No, I'm gonna put this thing. I don't really want. I don't want the 24 hours. Have I not done the. I did sign the extended shift. Ceremonial funerals. Those who give their lives in the service the city deserve highest honor. We will give the dead ceremonial funerals to inspire the living. Yeah, I don't really, that's not something I care about right now. Extra rations for the ill. Use extra rations in the medical facility to speed up recovery. Well, we don't have extra rations right now. I kind of feel like we need to do this. Overcrowding. Since we have problems with, with people. Although this might be a good idea. Amputees fitted with prostheses in medical facilities will be able to work again. Yes, I'm gonna I'm actually gonna sign this one. But yeah, but I just want this place to have, I just want this place to run the 14 hour shifts. I don't want it. Why can't I do that? Oh, is this it? Let's do this until we get our food stabilized. Generator heat zone. Low on coal. Well, sort of. Wall drill. I think... Well, this one might make the most sense, the medical upgrade, considering the fact that we have a lot of sick people. But what? I'm trying to find that. Allows us to build bunk houses. Medically protected from the weather. So do we deal with the hunt the sick people we have now, or do we try to produce less by having bunkhouses? That's the question right now. Long term, short term. Well, it's long term, medium term, I guess, is the question here. Let's do bunkhouses. Alright, so who makes prosthetics? I kind of misunderstood that. Factories, I thought it said, right? Resource depot, gathering post, sawmill, coal thumper, steelworks. The steam hubs would increase the heat somewhere. Let's actually, so if we put a steam hub, it actually goes over a street? 
Yes. So if we put a steam hub like right here, we'll hit all three of these. Put that right there. I need to probably put together another scouting party. But we don't have the we don't have the citizens? Really? Good for me. So heat actually reaches all the way out there as it is. Actually, you know what? Stop this. Cancel. Our our temperature zone is reaching far enough as it is right now. I don't need it. I don't need it further. to treatment. About two days to recover. Hmm. 21 hours left. And that's before we're about to hit a thing here. I should probably put these guys on a 10 on a uh, 10 hour shift. We'll see. Feeling better about our, our colony or our city here than I did at the beginning of this episode. <laughs> still still not necessarily great, but I'm feeling much better than I did. Temperature's gonna drop one level, yeah. Coal's gonna definitely be an issue here pretty soon, but let's uh let's stop here for today, and I'll see you guys later.